In this video, I will show you how to make a book cover for Amazon KDP for free in minutes. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is go to selfpublishingtitans.com. Then you need to go to this little tool section here. We follow that across to this button, which is the book cover maker. That will take you to the book cover creator details screen. And for this example, we are going to put notebook for the title. Now you can decide whether it's a paperback, a hardcover, or even an ebook. For this one, we're going to do a paperback. Decide on what type of paper it's going to be. We are going to pick white. Next is the size and the page count. We are just going to leave them as they are for now. Then you just simply need to press the create button. Now we are on the main book cover creator dashboard. Here is where we are going to be designing our book cover. Here is where we're going to see all our layers on our design. And here is where all our creative elements are. Now, when you are making a book cover design, you want to make sure you stay away from these purple zones. Those purple zones are where the book's going to be cut when it is printed. Also, this yellow box is where the barcode's going to be, so be mindful of that too. Now, the first thing that you need to do when creating a book cover is to create a background. And using this tool, there's lots of different types to choose from. Look, you've got things like gradients, antiques, adults, kids, stuff like that. Let's just take a look here. Look at all these different types here. Now this is a popular one, sort of like an antique retro look. So let's have a look at this. Let's click on here. And what we want to do is we want to pull that into place. So if we kind of just cover it completely, let's pull that down here and let's pull that across and let's pull that to about midway on that first crease. There we go. Then what we can do is we can take this, we can duplicate it. And if we just flip that, we can then place that on the other side. Now, what you probably notice here is there's a big massive space in the middle, which we don't want. So what we want to do is we want to give it a spine. Now, what we can do is if we go to elements, go to shapes, press rectangle, Let's pull that kind of roughly in the center, about there. And if we just make that black, let's pull that down to here. And if we make that about equal size, and we can pull that to the top, and we can pull that to the bottom, there is our background done. So if we just click onto this, we can reduce the transparency so that we can see where those purple areas are that we need to stay away from. Because this is a notebook example, we need somewhere for people to write their name or whatever. So what we would do is go over to Elements, go onto Images and click this, which is the Name Tags. If we press this pre-done label, let's click on that, that will drop that onto our design, like so. Let's make that into a kind of correct size put that in the right orientation away from these zones and the last thing is just return the transparency back to 100 percent there we go and as you can see there that is our notebook cover really simple really quick so the last thing to do is either save that or download it now if we want to download it for Amazon KDP, we need it to be a PDF and it needs to be very high quality. Once you've downloaded that, that will be perfect for uploading straight to Amazon KDP. But there's lots of other things that this thing can do other than just making notebook covers. You can add text. And you have a range of different fonts that you could potentially use. There's lots of different elements that you can have as well. You can even add people. Look, this woman is having a great time, an absolute fantastic time there. There's even a stock images section. Whereas if you click on there, you can kind of have a look at all this stuff which you could use as a background for your cover. Let's have a go at these clouds. So that's instantly changed the cover. And if we just sling that back to the top, and there's our notebook. So there's our second cover version, as simple as that. You even have a section here to upload anything that you potentially want. So you might have some third party images or assets which you found online. You can do that there. 
But if you haven't found any elements to upload, well you can just go to the elements section, go to general, and have a look at any of these that you could use. Like look, there's flowers, um, leaves, footballs, and the list goes on and on. Now, I will leave a link to the completely free book cover creator in the description below. And if you want to check out the full range of self-publishing titans tools, today would be the day because there's a 40% sale on. So go and make the most of that, my mates. If you found this video useful, then don't forget to leave it a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And until next time, bye.